I know your steps are taken heavier now, and that even small glances shudder your rib cage. I know even scents fleeting in the breeze make you stop and shake. I know that every little picture, movie, joke, song, street, book, cafe, store, and restaurant bring tidal waves of memories. Trust me, I know. But why? Maybe because you pumped me full of devotion. You gave me inspiration. I gave you my adornment. I gave you my awe. I dedicated sonnets to the tones of your voice. I filled canvases with the pigments of your skin. I embellished page after page after page in descriptions of the dips in your chest and your neck and your arms where I would rest in comfort like they were warm pools of water. I looked at you as though you forged the seven wonders of the world, but you were the only wonder in mine. But muses do waver, and you are not constant. Did you not see that my grip was slipping, and my hands too callous to hold on to the love clenched between my palms any longer? Maybe if the blows you gave me have shown through my skin, you would have seen it. You would have stepped back. If whenever you would yell and scream, my flesh would dot purple where the words beat my skin. If each time you turned away, the tears I let fall onto my hands burned holes into them like cigarettes. If the cracks inside my chest branched over my limbs each time your disappointed glance washed over me, maybe then you would have at least seen it. I almost wish your words had slashed my skin, because at least then I would have seen it before I developed scars. But you reached your borders, and I was right behind them, waiting for you to see that there's a line between words and actions. I wanted you to understand. I wanted you to cross. But you just kept moving your lips and holding out your hand for me to run towards you. But I knew it. This was your limit. This was our divide. That dotted line was a thick wall of glass in your eyes that only saw my pretty face but couldn't hear a word. I was silently screaming. But there it was, as far as you could go, and I couldn't change your endings.